Well, one of the things it does is it gives you something to measure up your freshmen and your players upon where they return from over the summer. Uh, typically, you know, in some sports they don't get that preseason, so to speak, but that's where we get our preseason from. It gives us the opportunity to evaluate our freshmen, uh, see how they play, mix around lineups, um, and uh, just kind of gives the girls a reward too, so not just practice for four weeks in the fall, but also you have an incentive to be able to play games on the weekend. Uh, we've got some normal opponents. We have uh, App State coming in this weekend, who's a normal doubleheader in the spring, and then UNC Greensboro and ECU was a big opening weekend for us. And other than that, we have some divi strong Division II programs in Wingate, uh, St. Andrews University, and then of course you can see there's some junior college teams on the schedule. So we'd like to be able to play those. Maybe there's some players that we're going to look to recruit off of their programs. Um, and you know, travel is limited, so we can't go as far in the fall, but the, the big key is that we're out there on the field and being able to play other teams. Uh, we've seen our freshman class come out very strong, ready to compete. I think we've seen a lot more enthusiasm in our team. We've seen definitely a resurgence of power in our lineup, uh, whereas probably in the past we've been more of a quick-footed team. Now we're uh, hitting the long ball. I've hit over seven home runs yet this, so far this fall. So I think we've got more inter-squad competition than we've had in years. So we're balancing a lot of position players back and forth, uh, trying to find that right mix. It's a very strong class. Eight, eight freshmen came in, uh, one of the biggest classes we've ever had. Um, but in that power that I mentioned earlier, we have several freshmen who have contributed that. Uh, Chelsea Liscatos, Jesse Fennell, Haley Lewis. Uh, we've got two freshmen working in the 1-2 spot, which is a tough position for them. But uh, I think everybody's really living up to the expectations, but maybe even a little bit beyond that. So we're excited to see that uh, so many freshmen, with the loss that we have and the lower number of returners, but that the freshmen are going to be able to contribute right away. Well, that's the time that uh, we'll sit down, we'll have meetings with each player, and basically at that point we're going to look at specific skills. You know, what are the two or three things that are going to change, that you need to change and get better at? So when it comes time in February for the first game, you're an improved player. Uh, what are you going to do to get yourself in the lineup day in and day out? The things that we see maybe that you're missing, and we're going to identify those and see if you can work through, through those in individual workouts up until that point.